And we are back. Hello, guys. Thanks for joining us. Uh, we're doing a review today of A Million Miles Away. We literally just watched this movie. Literally. Yeah. Just so, finished. <laughs> Linda, you know, we've been wanting to watch this movie. We reacted to the trailer. We got some comments on the trailer reaction. So I was like, you know what? Let me review this movie. Um, what did you think? Oh, man, where did I start? I mean, I had to go put makeup because I was a ball crying for this movie. Uh, it was it's one of the movies that really, really makes you feel like, oh, so good and like such a well-thought movie. And I think it, it did justice to what the real person in real life went through. Mm -hmm. And Michael Peña did such an amazing job as being the main actor on this movie. And it just, it's put a mark, you know. And as an immigrant myself, you know, coming to an unknown country by myself, it really made me relieve a lot of things that you go through, you know, and that you fight through to get to a point in your life. And that's, this movie is just like a lot of things together. And it's just well put. And I loved it. The acting, everything. The story was amazing. And I think the director, she did an amazing job. So you're giving it a two thumbs up? I'm giving it, like, yes, two, five stars, whatever it is, the, the highest. I forgot what we're doing, but I think two, two thumbs two up. Two thumbs up. <laughs> All right, let's, let's go with the thumbs up this okay. time. I'm giving it, you know what, before I give my review, let me get into this movie. Okay, so it's a true story. Right. And the fact that it's a true story and you know it's a true story and that person is still exists, the real mm -hmm. person that went through this journey, that grew up, you That's know, horrible. working with his family, picking fruit, picking grapes, immigrants, making that journey from Mexico to California, you know, seeing him struggling as a kid trying to get an education while the parents were moving all over the place. He has this dream. For me, it made it that more impactful knowing that this actually happened. Mm -hmm. That somebody that came from a family that's not well off, not the best education, but was persistent in their dream is what made this movie like extra inspiring. Mm -hmm. Like so inspiring. And I think there's so many good qualities about this movie. There's so many life lessons mm -hmm. that you could take from this movie. Right. Right. And and just the first of all, the mindset. Even though the father, right, he didn't have a great education. He, he was a he, he probably no education, farm worker. But the family's work ethic and the and the father's philosophy about how to succeed in life, about having a goal. Having the goal. What is your goal? Right? That's the first step. A lot of people don't even have a clear idea of what the goal is. But the father giving the son these kind of set of life principles to live by um, is what put him in this path. So it, it for me is incredible because even though the father didn't have a formal education, that one belief, that one set of ideas on how to achieve a goal, first of all, finding what your goal is, then the next step, then working harder, that, that led him to being able to achieve his dreams, incredible. And yeah. I feel like the, I feel like the movie is full of great lines, and so like, many, yeah. so many good lines. Like I love the part where the cousin is like, "What, what better person than to explore space than an immigrant, right? Who's risked it all to find a better life in another country, like an unknown country? Where exactly. You don't have the language. You don't have, you know. Mm -hmm. You don't know anything. You don't, you know, you don't have your close family nearby to guide you or to give you the shelter that you need. So it is incredible. I yeah. mean, you said it well said. And, and the lines, the way that the movie was paced, you know, like recipe one, recipe two, recipe, recipe three, mm -hmm. you know, like all that. It was amazing how the lines of the father, you know, at the beginning yeah. of the movie. And that's how he kept going and kept going. I mean. You know, are we saying spoilers or not? No, no spoilers. Okay, no well, spoilers. the many times that he pursued to be part of this, right? Mm -hmm. Be part of NASA. There's so many times. And, like, 
and you just kept going and he mm. just kept going and the fact that this was a true story it was incredible like how many times are you gonna do that that's true it's, in, it's inspiring i tell you <laughs> it, it's an inspiring movie and another great line that i like about the movie is um I mean, no spoilers here, but somebody tells this character that tenacity is a superpower. Yeah. And that is so true. You yeah. might, let's say you're not the most talented person or the smartest person or the most well-educated person, but if you have that tenacity, what? Yeah. That will take you places. Yeah. yeah it inspired yeah. me. Fun fact, fun fact about me, guys. I, I applied for NASA once. This comes as a surprise for me. <laughs> to be a technical, to, to be a tech, uh, guys, as my profession, I'm not just a YouTuber. I'm a, I'm a broadcast technical director. <laughs> That's what I do for a living. YouTube do this in front of the camera. YouTube, YouTube doesn't pay me enough. <laughs> for a living, I, I'm a broadcast technical director. And back in the day, I applied to be a broadcast technical director for NASA. <laughs> I thought you wanted to fly to space. I was like, no, how can no. you not tell your wife no, that you no, want no, no, to no, fly no. to space? <laughs> I didn't get the job. I didn't get the job. But you know what? I'm going to go look for that job again. I'm going to go look for that job. I'm going to see if they're, I'm going to see if they're hiring again. I'm going to be no. like, I'm going to be like, NASA, I watched the movie. You know which movie I'm talking about. I'm here for that job. Oh, you God. still need a technical director. I'm your guy. You're hilarious. <laughs> I, I, I can't. I can't. That's, that's, that's right here. That's him. He drives me crazy so anyway, every day. <laughs> I thought it was a very inspiring movie. I enjoyed it. Uh, I love the cast, the whole family. The Everybody dynamic did a great, the a dynamic, family. the How many, wife. Oh, my God. The wife was incredible. And yeah. I kind of relate to her because I was like, you know, I love to cook, and it was, you know, that's something yeah. that is her passion. And I was like, oh, my God. She opened her restaurant. Yeah. It was amazing. The movie yeah. was amazing. You got to watch it. You, you got to go watch see it. it. Uh, directed by Alejandra Marquez Abella. Abella. How do you say her last name? I want to get it right. Alejandra Marquez Abella. She did an amazing job with this movie. And uh, it's something about the way they incorporate the, the music yeah, and everything. Mm -hmm. It's touching. It's a touch. Yeah. And it's I a, mean, it has humor, how too. How many times do you feel your eyes watering? Somebody must have been cooking onions. There's, somebody's chopping onions around here. I don't know what was going on with my eyes. It's okay. It's a good thing. It's a humble how, thing. How dare they? <laughs> like the father. Like the father. The father cries. Like, no, no. no nothing happening. Nothing <laughs> happening. Nothing's <laughs> going on here. Now I'm going on. <laughs> anyway, I give this movie a two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. I gave it two thumbs up. And, you know. I mean, it's an Amazon Prime, Amazon so Prime. see it. It's, it's well worth the time. Yep. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe. Smash that like. Press that like button. The, the notification bell. It helps yes. out. See you guys later. Bye. Peace out. Thanks for watching.